Hey everyone, Tales of Greninja here. Today I'm going to see what happens if you put a foreign cartridge into a Game Boy Advance. Here are the games I'll be testing. Tetris for the Game Boy. Pokemon Crystal for the Game Boy Color. Super Mario Land 6 Golden Coins for the original Game Boy. Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland for the Game Boy Advance. Cartoon Network Collection Limited Edition for the GBA Video. Sonic Rush for the Nintendo DS. Detective Pikachu for the 3DS. Sonic 2 for the Game Gear. Spider Man and Friends Talk Ox Challenge for the V Smile. And Asteroids for the Atari 2600. Let's get into the video. First up, we have Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland for the Game Boy Advance. And as you can see, the game works. Next up, Tetris for the Nintendo Game Boy. As you can see, it works. Um, I'll have to blow into the cartridge. Just to show that it really works. Okay, there we go. And as you can see, the game works. Next up, Pokemon Crystal for the Game Boy Color. And as you can see, just like the original Game Boy, it works. There you go, the game works. Next up, Super Mario Land 2 6 Golden Coins Japanese version for the Nintendo Game Boy. And as you can see, it's region locked, so you can play Japanese Game Boy games on your Nintendo Game Boy Advance. Next up, Cartoon Network Limited Edition for the GBA Video. Not compatible with Game Boy Player, sadly. And as you can see, it works. Next up, Sonic Rush for the Nintendo DS. It doesn't fit all the way, but let's still try it anyway. Alright. Oh, and it just fell right out. I didn't even notice that. Hmm. Well, uh, it does not work, sadly. Next up, uh, Detective Ryan Ren- I mean, Detective Pikachu for the Nintendo 3DS. This one also does not fit, so my little plan is I'm gonna put the DS game to hold it, hold it in place. And we'll see if either one of them will read. And, uh, yeah, it does, does not work, sadly. Oh well. Next up, Sonic the Hedgehog 2 for the Sega Game Gear. And it does not fit. Alright, how about Spider-Man Friends Doc Ox Challenge for the V-Smile? And it sort of fits, so let's... Or I guess not. Alright then. Alright, how about finally we'll do Asteroids for the Atari 2600. I'll make sure I put it in the right way. Just like this. And nothing, so uh... Yeah, alright. Atari 2600 games don't work. Well, um, that concludes my video, so I hope you guys enjoyed watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.